Hello, Krzysiunet. Uh, I will show you a new version of Inkscape. Uh, it's an unstable version. It's uh, In Inkscape uh, 0.91 uh, pre-3. Uh, so, uh, I, I will have uh, six points, uh, which uh, will be uh, new functions of this version, version which was uh, released, uh, binary version was released uh, just uh, one or two weeks ago, or maybe three weeks ago, I don't know, but, but recently. Uh, and it will be more for experienced users uh, who used in ink in the past, uh, but uh, if somebody wants to learn Inkscape, uh, just show, uh, just just look uh, what it can do. Uh, I will show you as, as well. Uh, so for such users, uh, I will tell what is uh, this tool. Uh, this is uh, Inkscape. It's open source, open uh, free, uh, open as free. Uh, free as open, uh, so you can uh, download it for free, you can use it for commercial works, uh, nobody will make you pay for this or, or for using your works, uh, so if you know uh, GIMP, it's like GIMP, but it's, it's for the uh, vector graphics, vector graphics is like GIMP is for the photos, this is for the uh, shapes, for the lines and, and things like that. Uh, we have now a neck uh, by, by mistake. Mm, so let's uh, begin with uh, guides. Uh, some cool shortcut uh, for, for the guides is uh, to uh, click on the ruler uh, and uh, drag in onto the doc document. So let, let's make uh, uh, some guides, and now if you want to edit it, just double click on it, and you will see uh, new functions. You can change the color of the uh, just one uh, guide, and name it, name it foo. Uh, this will be green. Somebody knows what will be how how will be named? Yes, it will be a bar, uh, and now we will have uh, with forty five and angled forty five degrees uh, guide name uh, full bar, uh, and we will make it black, painted black. Uh, the the font won't change the size of the font when you zoom uh, up, zoom in, uh, zoom out. So as you see it's a very native function, you can of course change the, uh, the, the size of the font uh, in preferences. Uh, so this is the, the first uh, cool thing, so, so setting the properties to the individual uh, guides and setting names. Uh, let's uh, let's show you uh, the the spray. Uh, let's begin with with uh, drawing some face. Two eyes. Some smile. Make it red and the, the face itself. Uh, I'm using some uh, keyboard shortcuts uh, because you know it's it's for experienced users. So I don't now don't I don't want to, to make a tutorial now. But if you want uh, to know how to draw something, uh, how to make it good, precise, uh, suitable for later editing, uh, then let me know just what do you want to draw, what do you want to know, and I will record it as as, as possible. Uh, 
So we have a face, uh, we will group it, so it's just a one, one object now. Uh, and a spray. Spray isn't like like normal spray, it's spraying with uh, copies or the clones of the objects. Uh, so we, we have to choose some randomness, uh, like like amount, let's make it... No, it's, it's not random, but uh, how many objects will appear. Uh, rotation, let's make it not very random, and or scale not very random, but, but rotation will be uh, very random, it's in, in, in percent. Uh, and just click and move your mouse and we have a lot of faces. Now you see it's it's like people I don't know melted up in, in hell in, in one big blob. It's it's not very nice. Uh, and this red eyes I don't know, so let uh use the next function uh new function uh called uh, object uh, arrange. Uh, as you see, we have eight rows and eight columns. Uh, is it uh, default? No, it's uh, based on the uh, count of the objects uh, as uh, Inscape uh, counts the, the objects and, and tell us what will be the best. Uh, sometimes, as you see, it's it's it was eight. Now it's seven. It's, it's like always in Inkscape, uh, nothing is still. Uh, so just click on the arrange, and we have a nice grid. Uh, let let make it. I don't know. Mm, wider, so more columns uh, and rows are uh, changing as well uh, and make uh, a bigger spacing like 25 pixels range and now we have uh, another grid and more like uh, wider, just wider. Uh, okay, so uh, this, this was uh, another function, new function. Uh, and now uh, we want to change the eyes. I don't know because you know we, it was melted up in hell. People melted up in, in one blob in hell, and we want uh, we we uh, already separated them into the, the separate beings, and now they are still have a red eyes, so it's not very nice. Uh, in the uh, past version of Inkscape, we had to uh, click on the every eye uh, to to choose uh, what what we want to uh, to to change all the the red eyes. And now we just click on the one object. Mm, it's it's a red fill, so we click on the. A view. Oh, okay. Uh, on the object, uh, I'm sorry, on the edit, uh, select same, fill color. And now, as you see, uh, every eye is selected because every eye is red. And uh, now make it, I don't know, like this, or not like this. Uh, and now uh, let's change it to, to the uh, some other kind of, of blue uh, other shade. Mm. And now again click on the blue eye view uh, object uh, edit. Select same, fill color, and we have uh, filled, uh, selected uh, these eyes, except that because that uh, that is another color. Uh, okay, so uh, we want now to to exchange places because we want 
it to be here like like that but it's uh, it's a nice grid uh, we don't want to change that and and we want to make it pixel precise uh, we don't have any more to to move uh, our objects just click on the two objects uh, select two objects uh, and uh, object align and distribute uh, now we have uh, some new group rearrange uh, and we are uh, clicking exchange position of selected objects and it's it's changed uh, if we select more objects it will uh, it will uh, exchange it in uh, in 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 the loop uh, so like like that and as you see it's <laughs> it's very very funny very cool uh, so uh, the another I don't know function or call it as as you will uh, it's that many uh, windows are in the uh, can be docked, uh, so uh, we couldn't dock uh, the, the the export uh, image, and now we can. And if we want to uh, to export a lot of objects, it will be much faster because, as you see, we just click here, click here, click here, and it's done. Uh, and the performance of the in ink is much much better uh, so okay the uh, next uh, function will be a uh, ruler uh, so make uh, let's make uh, the, the, some face here degroup it and uh, we want to uh, to check uh, I don't know like like uh, what is the distance between this point and this point uh, we have to select snapping uh, and snap to the cusp nodes it's it's the it's it's the end point uh, and then click on the ruler so it's snapping here handle to cusp node click drag and to the other cusp node and we see it's uh, 1 and 80 uh, pixels uh, wide and the angle is uh, 50 uh, 53 uh, degrees uh, it is a very cool uh, it's as you see uh, we see uh, much more now uh, it's it's very powerful tool uh, and I think that the uh, next uh, thing will be would be swatches swatches are kind of palettes uh, you can you can make your own palette uh, but we will uh, choose uh, like uh, Android icon palette or I don't know greens so now we have a palette of greens or uh, royal I don't know this is colors from the maybe coat of arms I don't know uh, and now just click on the object uh, and click on the color here here and this is without fill but stroke so just click with shift uh, or with uh, the, the right mouse button and set stroke uh, so we have uh, a royal royal face group it select with the others uh, arrange and it's now arranged and now we want to move it uh, we want to, to, to make it more uh, square like uh, so 
we will make like this uh, and now make it in the in the middle uh, so click on the two objects rearrange and we have it in the middle uh, so so it's it's really cool uh, and and now the, the uh, we want to make all uh, eyes more royal uh, so so we click on the uh, one eye uh, again uh, select same uh, fill color uh, and and make it like that uh, and and here on the smile it's again it's uh, only a stroke uh, so uh, select same uh, stroke color and we can change it and uh, now now I change to the, the fill so so it it make it like that so so it's even better uh, but uh, now we want to I don't know add to a stroke to every cycle so we click on on it and uh, select same uh, object type and now every cycle is uh, is is set and we will set a, a, I don't know black stroke and we have uh, I don't know it, it could be even, even uh, some wallpaper later uh, and on the end uh, sometimes Inkscape uh, produce uh, 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 some weird code uh, that you can that, that causes that you can ever even uh, edit the document uh, you could use some tricks but the best way would be uh, edit it in the notepad uh, but now you have file clean up document it's not about i don't know some spots uh, cleaning up the spots it's cleaning up the code uh, it don't have any feedback so i think it should be changed but but we will see it's it's already uh, very great uh, and now exchange and and everything is changing uh, one object was degrouped so so now it's 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 just messed up but uh, but as you see uh, some functions are really cool uh, in the next uh, next uh, part i will show you some, some other functions and as i said if you know if you want to know how to draw something just let me know okay Thank you very much, Krishunet. Goodbye.